I'm on my way up to Panorama Peak, one of the high points of the Goldfield Mountains, a little bit north of Dome Mountain. I'm going to be leaving 1356 now, taking the road to the left here a little bit. All right, I'm about a tenth of a mile or so from the intersection of 1356 where I left it. And there's a little road here that should lead to the Dumb Mountain Trailhead. There's a tiny little cairn. So Panorama Peak, I've seen it, but never been there. Hopefully it'll live up to its name and have a nice panoramic view from the summit. It doesn't have much prominence. It might be the second highest point in the Goldfield Mountains. I'm not sure about that. Dome Mountain is the highest. All right, this is the saddle uh, east of Dome Mountain. I made it up here after losing the trail down below. I think I lost it right at the end of the road. I think it branched off earlier and I went downhill too far. Uh, vaguely remembered what my brother and I did when we hiked this and started to come up slope and I eventually found it. I've also noticed someone spray painted some white lines on the trail periodically, especially when it's rocky. Yeah, there's one right here. I don't know if there will be anything out to Panorama Peak or not, even like a faint use trail, but it's probably not going to be anything like this. All right, I made it to the summit of Doe Mountain. Anyway, Panorama Peak's right in the center now. I'm going to start heading down the ridge and make it out there. I don't know if there's going to be a drop off right here. It looks like there could be. Yeah. Uh, I think I can take the ridge down over there at least. Let's see what happens. I think I can make it down right here. Um, I'm going to have to be careful. But, uh, and then there still might be another cliff I'm faced with, but I'll see what I can do. All right, well, I'm not going to make it for sunrise, but I'll be there probably within 20 minutes. I can see the summit of Panorama, and uh, it's not too far. I'm just pretty much taking the ridge now. Okay, yeah, so I'll just skirt this high point here, and then that's it. The ridge will lead directly up to the summit, and there'll be another peak, and uh, hopefully a nice panoramic view. All right, I just worked my way from over there, and I'm right below the summit block. Here's the summit of Panorama Peak. All right, I'm going to give you the panoramic view. There are the four peaks, then a little bit lower down, the Golden Dome, Mount Ord. Mazatzal Peak, Stewart Mountain. There's East End, high point of the McDowell Mountains. Red Mountain. And then you can see Camelback. And then it's pretty hazy over the valley. And then Dome Mountain is right there where I came from. You can see Newman Peak and then Mount Lemon. And then the front range of the Superstitions and Weaver's Needle. Under those rocks right there is a little plastic bag with the summit log. The last entry was uh, February 28th, maybe just a week ago, I guess. Not too long. It's March 4th today. Um, but otherwise, it's pretty sparse. Not too many people have been up here. One guy was saying, keep the gold fields wild, delete all trails and stuff like that. <laughs> She's probably not going to be happy with this video. But um, if you are interested in something a little more remote, but not too far from the Dome Mountain Trail, this is pretty cool. Yeah, I think I'll go back the way I came. So let me show you what I did from here. Okay, so I came up from this way along the ridge. I skirted the ridge in a few places, but probably should have just stuck with it as much as possible. So follow the ridge. So I'll drop down there, and then I think I was at the bottom of that cliff right there. Kind of worked my way level above the rock right there. And then I worked my way down from that corner right in the center now. Right in the center, that's where I down climbed, somewhere on the other side of that. 
Since we are on top of Panorama Peak, this would be a really good time for the summit selfie panorama. You know, the one where our deer hiker makes it to the summit and proceeds to give us the beautiful panoramic view with anywhere from one eighth to three quarters of the screen being taken up by his face. That's just what I call breathtaking. All right, off the summit, heading back along the ridge. All right, here's my first up climb right here. So I down climb this. This shouldn't be too bad. And then I'll head up and then off to the right and then do the little bit harder climb to get back up on the ridge. I do see what looks like a potential route cutting up right there. I think I'll just go back the way I came just to make sure, which is over here. All right, that's it right here. Um, I would say this is probably a fourth class climb. This is the slope of it here. I did down climb it. I felt okay. It looks a little bit steeper than I thought it was now. Anyway, let me give it a shot. My foot slipped initially, and then I got a little bit better foothold lower down. There's some good handholds there. Made it up to where the cactus is. I actually had to kneel a couple times. I used my knee. Made it up to where the cactus is. And I climbed up right above the cactus right to here. When I went down, I went over here because I didn't want to potentially land on the cactus and then work my way around that rock and then down this way. Uh, down climbing facing the rock, there's no way you could do this facing out. Yeah, there's the route right over there. And then this is going the other direction, so it's a pretty well defined ridge right here. It just drops off. This is another nice vantage point, Doe Mountain, the high point of the Goldfield Mountains. Maybe I'll run into someone coming up, who knows. All right, coming up on the saddle here. Man, this is just beautiful out here. You do not have to get too far from the Phoenix area to get awesome scenery. It's just awesome, just beautiful. There's Dome Mountain again. I should be at the road in a few minutes. Yeah, I don't remember seeing that pile at all in the dark. I probably didn't. Well, it just looked like a rock to me, but there's the trail. All right, I'm all finished up. That's it for the hike of Panorama Peak and Dome Mountain. It was 8.4 miles from here with 2,300 feet of elevation gain, three hours and 50 minutes. And the last hike for the next five to six weeks at least. All right, I appreciate everything. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Have a good next five weeks.